Yeah, man, you see the highlight package, man. This is CGA Got Game with my debut game for NBA 2K24. And we back in here with the Phoenix Sun shirts on. But listen, it's early, man. I haven't done enough packet pulling. But you see the roster right there. We got our brother White Chocolate, John Starks, both in the backcourt, Andrew Bogot, down low, Iguodala, and... Dennis Rodman, all right, not that, not that bad of a team. Not that bad of a team. It's not how I used to it. You know, I'm not used to it. And now you can see, man, we opening up the game, trying to figure out how to get the ball inside, feed the inside post, play a little defense, and boom. Scotty Williams looks like he's already making an impact on this game. And we are looking to move the ball down the floor. John Starks pulls. Whap. All right. Wet. Buckets. And John Starks is off to a great start, man. And let's get our D up right now. I'm working on my half-court defense. Normally, I'm pressing and uh, looking to trap, but I just don't have the athletes right now. Andrew Bokey gets lost, trying to double-team for some reason, and we give up an easy bucket on the inside. All right, look at that. Great play by Siakam, and he misses Andrew Bogot with the rebound, passing the ball up the floor to uh, John Starks. And the assist goes to Andre Iguodala, and that's all net. All right, big rebound off a missed free throw. Andrew Bogot looks down the floor, and yes, I called him Bogot on purpose. Kobe Bryant with the ball crossing over in front, and bam, left hand dunk over top of the Toronto Raptors defender, and take a look at that. That's all day long. Gracefully, RIP to Kobe Bryant, one of the greatest, one of the GOATs. Dennis Schroeder with the basketball dribble driving right there, and it's going to be an easy elbow jumper for the Toronto Raptors. And we come back the opposite way, giving the ball up to Iguodala, passing the ball up to John Starks, and then, whap, oh, my boy is on fire. My boy is on fire. Hitting corner three-pointers, and that's a quick nine points for John Starks. And as you can see, that allows us to get the ball back, the ball game back even, but Toronto still with the lead. Towards the end of the first quarter, Kobe Bryant, the ball, he gets a big screen from big Patrick Ewing, and Patrick Ewing gets the lob pass. He's moving down the floor like a tractor trailer. Mr. D-I-C-K with the miss coming out of Kansas. All right, advanced pass up the floor to Jay Will. White chocolate wet to end the quarter, and that's not too bad of a start to the day season right now, as you guys know, and you've been pulling packets for your NBA 2K. White Chocolate is not that bad of a player. No player over 90, really, 91 available at this particular point. And uh, it's hard to put together a team, man. You're going to have to spend some money for those who want to play this game. You have to spend some money. Great start to the season. All right. We're going to get ready to head into the second quarter. And we were down early in this game. But as you can see right now, we're up three, looking to get a baseline screen stagger screen if not uh, uh, a double screen and we have a, a pick on the ball by Ruben Patterson coming off the screen nice easy roll and a finish off the glass by Ruben Patterson and the game will continue Mr. D-I-C-K with the block alright block and it's advanced to go Bay Bryant and it's gonna be an easy scoop and a missed layup and I'm gonna tell you man finishing inside the lane has been very difficult for me for this game but I'm gonna work on it all right, Kobe Bryant with the ball, right-hand dribble. He's looking to score a pick from Dennis Robin, and that's going to be an alley-oop. Bam. All right, did you ever think they would be back on the floor together, Dennis Robin and Kobe Bryant, and that's going to be an easy two-hand jam to keep the momentum up for us, and you can thank John Starks for that. All right, Ding up on the ball right there, and there's Jason Williams poking it away from Dennis Schroeder, and that's going to be out of bounds. I don't know how it is, but that's the way it goes. All right, Andrew Bogan and Andre Iguodala checking back in the game for Hartford, Horford, and Kobe Bryant. And as you can see right now, for some reason, our offense is stagnant. We're waiting for screens, people coming off screen, screening away. We don't know what to do with the ball. We give it to John Starks, on-ball screen, two-man game, and step back, bam. That's what you get for going under the screen. 12 points for your boy, John Starks. A missed three as the shot clock winds down, and John Starks sees himself with the ball top of the key again. All right. Oh, going under, and it's a miss, and John Starks finally cools off. Dennis Schroeder with the three on the other side. Big 
Rebound by Dennis Rodman, and he's going to look to bring the ball up the court. Passes it to White Chocolate, underhand pass. John Starks, baseline drive, dunk, and your boy is having the game of his life. At least he's having the first half of his life. First half winding down. Big rebound by Bogot. There's White Chocolate advancing to Starks, and he misses, but it's the offensive rebound by Iguodala. Dumping it back on the inside. Quick pivot facing the basket. Quick dish over to Bogot, and it's a miss. All right, last second shot by Schroeder, and it's going to be a miss. Dennis Rodman and, and Lafayette Lever with the miss from three-quarter court. Not too bad, man. I hope you're enjoying this. We do this for fun over here. Some people do it for funds, but we do it for fun, and it is halftime with CGA Game right here on the CGA channel. Do me a favor. Hit the like button. Our top performer for today's game is going to be John Starks at halftime with a quick 12 points, 12 of the 27 points. So he's operating efficiently for us. And we got the lead here starting the third quarter. And we're looking to work on our offensive game right here. So we're going to play a little bit of baseline screen, dump it onto the inside. Andrew Bogot kicks it back out. Andre Iguodala messing up, but hey. Kicking it back out with the offensive rebound. And offensive rebounds is going to win you games. Passing it up back to the inside. And we can't score. We can't buy a basket. We can't hit the broad side of a barn. On ball screen, which we like to double and step out. But that's going to that's gonna end up with a interesting, an interesting Euro step. And that's going to be a bucket for the Toronto Raptors. Opening up the half with some momentum. We haven't scored, but they scored twice. And that's going to cut the lead to six. That's going to cut the lead to six real quick. Moving the ball up the floor, and we're just throwing the ball over there, all over the damn gym. All over the damn gym. And that ain't going to cut it. We came out sluggish after halftime. On ball screen for John Starks. Looking to cross somebody up. We can't beat anybody to the basket. He takes a bump. Misses it. D. Rodman with the offensive rebound and the putback. That's why we got the big man right there. NBA all-time rebounder do you think he's the best rebounder of all times well that's what it's gonna be pick pass by jay will white chocolate with the scoop finger roll with the two-man give and go with dennis rodman and we back with the momentum 10 point lead a double off the ball screen and that's gonna be another steal by jason williams and he hands it off to andre gradala we can't beat anybody to the basket at all. So we're going to pull the ball out, kick the ball out to Dennis Rodman, who finds John Starks. And that's going to be not wet, but big offensive rebound. And that's the way you do it. That's the way you win games by crashing the boards. And we got some big men downside, down in the inside. And that's going to be the end of the third quarter. We're up 12 after being buried earlier. And we got the momentum. And that's how we're going to do it, man. John Starks showing up. He's going a little bit of ice cold. He's running out of bullets. But we got him now to finish the fourth quarter. And there we go with the inbound pass. Normally, these teams come out with something set. And they get an easy drive to the basket dunk. No help side defense. No ball pressure. And that's what you get. White chocolate advancing the ball up the floor. We got John Starks with the pump fake. Easy three-pointer. Two feet off the line from deep. And that's going to... Make that game. There it is. The third steal off the on-ball screens, and that's why you double Kobe Bryant ahead of the defense, and he dunks it home. Take a look at this. Shifts it back to the left and the right, and that's going to be a left-hand dunk. Long three-pointer by the Raptors, and they're starting to get cold, and we're starting to get hot. I know it's a low-scoring game. White Chocolate advances the ball down the floor, and what happened? You ain't never seen nothing like this. 20 points for John Starks with the big assist from J. Will, and that's going to be a defensive play right there. Look, come on, man. Play some defense. Sorry, right, John Starks tightening up on defense, as you can see right there, putting the clamps all on top of Gary Trent Jr., all on them like white on rice and fly his own. All right, there we go right there with a miss, and that's going to be the end, ladies and gentlemen. What did you think? That's going to be the end right there of the quarter. And the score, the dominant game. What do you think, man? Been dominating this game? Yes, we have been. What is the score? All right. There you go right there. Going under the screen on Gary Trent, doubling it up. And that's going to create turnovers. And turnovers create points and second chance opportunities. We crash the boards. And that's how I train my team. Dennis Schroeder upset. Andrew Bogat 
becoming an MVP for this game. What do you think? All right. Big pressure down on the perimeter right here. Mr. D-I-C-K from Kansas looking to drive the ball easy on the inside. And there's what happens, man. You come out of halftime or a timeout or the end of the quarter possession. Toronto is most likely going to score. On ball screen for the legendary Kobe Bryant. He doesn't use it, but slipping the pick is Al Horford. And that's a dunk. Look at that slip screen. Plenty of time for Al Horford to gather gather and dunk the basketball. All right, here we go. Mr. D-I-C-K crossing over Jay Will with an easy scoop. And Toronto cutting this lead down to 14 or 16. And here you go right here. Al Horford outside of his mind taking a long offensive uh, three-pointer right there. And it's a miss. Toronto coming back down the floor. Easy inside to Siakam. And that's going to be a timeout for us, man. We got to run the floor. Get back in transition defense. 14-point lead for the Raptors. Sorry, for the Suns with 344 left. All right, looking to run something out of a timeout. We got a stagger screen down on the baseline. Al Horford coming around. We don't want him to shoot a three, but he curls to the basket. Right-hand finish. Way to read your defense. All right, we don't need you out there shooting threes. All right, see, I come with a elbow jumper missing. And I think the momentum is changing. Advancing the ball up to one. Kobe Bryant pulling up. And he's wet. He's wet. All right. And that's going to be a big lead. Opening it up. 19-point lead. And driving to the basket is nothing here. But it's a dribble handoff to Kobe Bryant. Beans is green. I think that was Kobe Bryant. All right. I might be wrong. Might have been Ruben Patterson. It don't matter. All right. Missed shot by us. And coming down the floor is going to be the Toronto Raptors. And that's going to be it to end the game. Devin Harris with the miss. Ruben Patterson with the dap. A 20-plus point win. And we're going to start to build this team up. All right? And I want you to join me for the rest of the season here. Join me for the rest of the season. And we're going to build this team up to the team that you saw me in with on NBA 2K23. All right. Hit the like button. We out.